Welcome to my channel. My name is Attila and this is Masterpiece. So several months ago I have seen a very interesting perfume bottle. Obviously it was made of glass and probably glass was poured into a mold. So it was fairly easy to make and I am thinking about how to how to make it from wood because the shape is not something that is usually wood turned and uh, I am going to try to develop a technique to mimic that shape so pretty much 100% the same shape but I am not sure how to do that so let's go downstairs and join me on this journey when I try to figure it out how to do it Mustard piece. So I have wood, not just any wood, it's matched. Not like we are going to do anything with that fact, but it's matched. I want to round the bottom a little bit more, pretty much like this. So it sits, but it's, it is more like a ball shape. I'm probably going to just glue something here and use that as an extension. Let's do that. So I'm thinking about how to do this and I don't think my first approach will work. So what I originally wanted to do, I wanted to cut pieces of wood in an angle, glue it together and try to shape it into a sphere, but that's not going to work. So. I might just try to insert it from the bottom. Let's try that and see if that works. Last time I used this wormhole screw, I almost cut it off. It just grabs on to so tight. I usually drill a really small hole. It's secure, but sometimes it's like crazy to take it off.
So now we got unsubscribe. So do you see this line? I am going to part the lid on this line and I am probably going to do a walnut insert here. Alright, we are getting somewhere, definitely, because I have just realized my second approach doesn't work. See, if I want to uh, insert this ball, there will be a huge gap. I could fix it, but I don't want to. And I have also realized that the first approach is actually perfect. It would work. My worry was it is going to be in an angle but if I cut it off, cut the top off in an angle it would divert back to the straight position. So fortunately I already cut this one into half so now it is going to be much much more difficult to do what I wanted to do for the first time and uh, it's a good news uh, I don't know why I have to think about that but it's definitely good so let's get to it <laughs> Walnut. Going to make an insert that keeps the lid on. That's the plan. Let's do that.
Okay, so basically I used a very simple trick. I cut three different rings in very similar angles and the idea would be if I twist the three rings into the right position I would be able to direct back the last piece, the smallest piece into the center position and that would be exactly parallel with the tail stock. So if I want to wood turn that piece it's going to be in perfect center and this is easier than you think it is show you that's pretty good see so now I am going to force a confident smile on my face so you feel much better and confident Mustard piece. Thank you for watching.